This is a clip from the hashtag Han and Suraya personal finance chit chat organized by Bank Negara Malaysia and Financial Education Network. Basically, Han and I answered questions we received from the audience. You can find the full clip in the description box. Enjoy! This next one is, uh, what's your biggest financial mistake? <laughs> Suraya, you, you take this one before. Oh, uh, shall I? Yeah. Okay. Um, in terms of mistakes, I have a lot. I don't have regrets. Um, but one that I do want to share here, and especially because you probably, I'm, I'm guessing people who tune in, you know, love financial stuff, so you probably get a lot of these advertisements. I have lost money from Forex before. <laughs> and this particular Forex platform says that, ah, it's so easy, you should deposit your money, and then you can copy somebody else's trade, and then their trades get like 100%, 200%, 1000% profit, and look how easily you can make money. I'm telling you, those are lies. Okay? So that is one of the financial mistakes I've made. I didn't lose a lot, but enough to tell you that I made that mistake and I will never do it again after this. Okay. I've got a, a not so exciting one. Mine is, um, I, I made a mistake in my younger days on stock picking without uh, the relevant training to do so. So. Um, you know, stock investment, specific shares, for example, uh, is a very, very uh, 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 large industry, right? With lots of very, very educated people. Uh, right, educated is not the right word to use. Very, very exposed people who do it day in and day out. They know a lot about how to do uh, specific stock picking and stock investing. You know, me in my younger days thought, you know, I'm a smart guy. I should be able to do it. So I went into various stocks which I thought were good because maybe I liked the, I liked the, the product that they were selling, you know. McDonald's, Domino's of the world, thinking, okay, look, uh, I know, I, surely I know this company. Uh, um, and, and for me, it was making stock investments without being a stock analyst, right? And these things exist for a reason, right? It was, it was like me trying to, uh, it's, it's like me trying to uh, 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 bake a cake without knowing as much about baking cake as, you know, these expert home bakers now, right? And trust me, if you, if you ask me to bake a cake, it would completely fail. Likewise, just because I'm a smart person doesn't, need, doesn't mean I know how to uh, pick stocks and th that's why the industry exists. So for any kind of uh, amateur or uh, kind of uh, non-stock picker, I, I have a day job, right? I don't, I don't trade stocks in my day job. Um, it's important, the lessons I learned from that mistake was um, you can't beat these guys over the long term, right? You might as well go with something which everybody know works, which is long-term diversified investments right, which in 20 years will make you rich, right? If you, just follow the, if you just follow the science, you won't go wrong versus having a chance of losing it all with a bad stock pick. So that's kind of my biggest mistake. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was, I think uh, the, the stock was, uh, uh, I can't remember what it was now. As in, I learned from it, I just, but I, I, I intentionally forgot that the, for what stock it was. Mm. <laughs> you deleted that yeah, part of your brain. Yeah, I, I, I just okay. remember, okay, learn from this mistake, but please, let's not revisit yeah. it anymore. Yeah. But if you do, uh, I want to plug, if you do want to learn about like stock picking, um, Bursa Malaysia has this um, amazing platform called MLT, Mirror, Learn and Trade. And inside there are um, professional stocks um, analysts. I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't not, remember what they are. Yeah, but they are professionals who are employed in fund management companies, right? And you can see how they, how they trade, how, what they buy, um, what is the what is the justification behind their um, behind their purchase? You get to see the different types of analysis, fundamental, technical, and that's you can really see it's it's much harder than just like pick and hope it will go well, right? There's so many strategies involved. So go in, um, especially if you are overconfident. <laughs> <laughs> then for me myself. For me personally, I went in there, I thought, oh, you know, Sraya, you know finance already. Go in there, felt like a loser. <laughs> humble yourself, basically. Hum uh, yeah, yeah. Go, yeah. Humble, humble go, get, go eat your humble pie there. <laughs> <laughs> I love that so yeah. much.